My sister lives so close to me. Oh, so close to me. My sister lives so close to me. So close to me. That's why it's so convenient when I need free groceries. If I could count the times she's hosted me, I'd have to use my toes to see. And even then, I doubt that I would have enough appendages to count the times. Oh yeah. Oh no. Her boyfriend is so welcoming. There is no hint of tension. That's why I always use his stuff and don't tell him when I visit them. <laughs> Most of the time when I swing by, it's due to some internal crisis. She welcomes me with open arms and offers me good life advices. It's a safe space. I cry with my sis. She's my guiding light, my true north Cyrus, lending me her ear so I don't suffer in silence. And in terms of her guidance, it's objectively true because it's totally unbiased. Her door is always open. It's an open door policy. And all her roommates want me there, even if it's just subconsciously. <laughs> it's not exactly pulling hair, sitting down to talk to me. I'm open-minded, generous, sensitive, and modesty is my number one most amazing quality. <laughs> my sister is so close to me in terms of proximity that it would take approximately 10 minutes if she'd walk to me. And if we left at the same time and traveled at the same pace, it would take half the time to meet at the same place, but she rarely visits my property. Her making any type of effort is really quite a novelty. It's not as if the commute is an odyssey. On the contrary, our homes are close together. One might say the same vicinity. We voted for the mayor at the same public facility. Maybe our relationship isn't as it seems. Cause the last time I popped over to let off some steam, she was busy with her girlfriends gossiping. Probably about fashion or Ryan Gosling. <laughs> I don't know. Point is, point is I couldn't get a comment in. She cold shouldered me, shook my core beliefs, and made me even more confused about my moral boundaries. Yeah, it's rocky, but I have no Apollo Creed. I stand for my rights, but I will not fight for an apology or manifest this projection of her self-fulfilling prophecy. For shame, times have changed. Gu guitar solo. It's like she's the id to my super ego And I know that this might sound super emo But when shit gets heavy like emotional hefo When it's all on the line like an OT free throw My mood's up and down like a Zodiac speedboat She keeps me grounded like an empty jet at Heathrow And she knows and we grow together My hero, my sister, my bloodkin, my sibling There's nothing between us except the bike path Which leads us together forever Oh Sarah, my sister Oh yeah, that's her name, her name's Sarah my middle name's James, hers is Marie, both named after friends of the family. We both wear gold chains with silhouettes of our faces and birth dates engraved by our granny. We live happily apart, I in an apartment, her in an heritage home with her boyfriend, his brother and partner, and one other girl who is single, kind of, two cats, and they all live so close to me. Thank you.